so much of their research and development is going into EV technology, which as they're moving to this carbon neutral lie in 2030. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Farce. <yeah. laughs> because let's believe, hey, let me, there's no fun. <laughs> Cadillac Andretti is trying to be their own team. I don't think they're trying to buy yeah. into it, yeah. right? So, and like when Audi comes in, uh, it, they're buying into a team yep. as well. Which, going through the history of Red Bull, this is very common to like see this kind of move around. And what's what's fun is that I mean, what a swing for the fences! Ford came in like we want to be yeah. the best right away. Yeah, and you know, I was making fun of Ford in a few episodes because. GM's coming in, or trying to at least, and GM has the uh, Chevy Corvette Z06, the C8 with the new flat plane crank. Like they're making really cool petrol motors, right? Yeah. And Ford is investing a ton of money in EV technology, which I said they're putting, I mean, so much of their research and development is going into EV technology, which as they're moving to this carbon neutral, lie in 2030 <laughs> uh, um, <laughs> Farce. Yeah. because let's believe hey, let me there's no fun. the only way that i think that they're going to be carbon new, quote neutral yeah. is they're gonna just be like well we routed everything better so now nah, yeah i think it's now we're net zero they donated to a carbon neutral agency that then signs off on them yeah, being 100 percent com- completely right? offset totally yeah so it uh it, it to me is really it's cool to see them swinging for the fences like that uh, to go to the very top. But now that they've done this, and I've read some articles on it, Horner even mentioned this as well. Um, you know, Horny Horner <laughs> is that they uh, Horner Spice. They, <laughs> yeah, they wanted a lot of that EV technology and in, in, in this turbo hybrid era that we're in. Uh, and I, I'm surprised I missed this. Yeah. What a great move. The, you're, like, you're putting all this research and development into your EV stuff. The motor is already fine. Clearly, the motor is fine. Yeah. So now Ford's getting some Honda technology from Honda Racing that Red Bull bought from Honda to make Red Bull powertrains. And Red Bull still has Honda support through the end of 2025. Uh, and then Ford's now going to get that information. So now it's almost like an American-made Japanese motor yep. with – the innovation of the EV stuff from Ford, uh, which, you know, again, we should probably have some Japanese EVs so it, you know, batteries don't blow up. But <laughs> I think that's pretty dope. That's great. Uh, like, like, I really think it's going to be a, a, a big move for him. What a complicated now, relationship that hopefully right? just keeps paying off. They're already at the it, top. It, so, dude. Awesome. And, ima- and I was thinking, like, as I'm reading this, I was thinking about the, the red tape that they had to go through. To solidify that deal, I can't imagine how much back and forth they're getting. Are we staying with Honda? They want to leave. Who are we going to get? Yeah. Was GM involved with this? Was Cadillac trying to hop in and they got a big hard no? So they went to Andre. Like I just would love to have heard that 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 information. Yeah. 